Welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth, that is. I'm Sergeant Kenai, let's get back into the game. Last we left off, we had a Samson run, which we did absolutely horrible in. But now it's time to go on to the Lost. The Samson run, we had a, okay luck, we were fine, but we were just really bad. It took an ass ton of damage, and I don't know, maybe our bosses weren't that great. Maybe, maybe we didn't get a lot of keys and bombs. We didn't get the right consumables when I wanted them. I feel like that would have made a huge difference. Double shots, not that bad to start off with. I'll take it. Um, and it, it just it didn't end uh, too well. Now let's look at the well. It's the lost. We don't need seeds for the lost. Here's the seed, anyways. C zero G Q S G eight zero. There you go. Boom bada bing. Want to play the lost with me and see if you actually survive? Go ahead, be my guest. Because more than likely, I'm not. He's got to come in with that mentality, like, I'm going to die. Even though it may or may not happen. I may survive. We will survive. Forget this song. I'm real bad and I deserve to be reprimanded for not remembering the lyrics. Whoa, game. Don't ever do that to me again. I don't like being that close to the gurglings. Because their charge is stupid. It is. I hate fighting things with charges. Because when you hit them, their charges like wonk the hell out. I'm getting a little too close for me there. They like, they're really wonky and they like shoot off in really weird freaking projectiles. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Oh, it was a damage up. Oh, it turned out good for us. Alright, I like it. I like it. We're not going into there, of course. We're not very ah. Uh, we got super slow. That's not good for the lost. Hopefully, we get a speed up then, sometime soon, because this is like really slow and really bad to fight the lost with, or the the lust with. That is like really bad. Oh man. Speed up! Oh, yes! Thank you, game. Another pill. Speed down! <laughs> Why you do this to me, man? Give me a speed up and a speed down right after? Game, please. What are you doing? Why you do this? Okay, you're dead. I'm happy about that. You're getting a little too close for me, though. All right! We're alive. We could go to the shop. We haven't found the shop yet. Nope. Uh, we don't have any holy sh freaking shenanigan. We don't have great range. We don't have great range and we don't have great speed. So we got great damage and we have good tier rate, but our speed and range are, are, are not that great. Um, That's... Thunder thighs that gives us HP. No, we don't want that because it's gonna destroy rocks, and we don't want to destroy rocks like that. You might say, yeah, you do, but no, that's like my main tactic for the loss is to hide on rocks. So that would uh, be really bad. If it was chemical peel on the other hand, which I often confuse that with, I would have definitely got it. But thunder thighs, no, it's an HP. I think it's it's a speed down too. So that would have been extra bad if I picked that up because it's a speed down. But absolutely horrible, actually. It's too bad we can't get that pill. Because that fires directly on top of it. And I, I doubt I would be able to maneuver. Let's see. Uh. Maybe I can. The fire went down a little bit. No, it's not happening. <laughs> I try it, you know. I was, I was trying to do the dream. The map is nice. Treasure map that is. Um, I'm gonna guess that the secret room's right here. It is, yay! It's got nothing of value in it. Well, it's got some fires we can blow up. It's not technically true, but they didn't drop anything, so really, it does have nothing of value in it. Oh well, maybe we'll get a better treasure room next floor. We still have the boss though. And this is uh, actually not a boss I would like to fight. Because it's going to make it... Uh, being slow is going to make it really hard to dodge. 
but yeah, so far so good actually I was a little worried we were gonna be overwhelmed but so far this hasn't happened I guess our damage is decent enough that it wasn't really much of a problem oh good for me a range up all right I like how this is going the nail I'll take it and I'll take uh what is this brother or sister Maggie and uh, is that a uh, speed up pills? Yay! Dude, we got range and two speed up pills. Th this couldn't have gone any better. Damn right. Oh, okay. I like what's going on. Now, we only use the nail for when we need damage. It's most likely going to be boss rooms. So, the nail only has limited uses because it can't give us anything beneficial. Uh, that we would... Fuck me and my asshole, man. That was, that was a good okay run. I was liking that run. And then that just had to happen. Whoa! Well. Alright. You know, I don't like spiders. Especially the ones that shoot three in, in different directions. Makes it really hard to dodge. What I should have done is probably ran up straight against the wall. Because I could fly. It would have probably been my best choice. And I could have killed one of them. And that's the Celtic Cross? I think I've got this item before, so it's a new item. I'm not exactly sure what it does, though. I don't think it does anything for good for the lost, unfortunately. Hmm. And it's a special item, I believe. So, I haven't really talked about much about special items, but I know when you find a special item, you're less likely to find another special item. So, this kind of, But it doesn't even matter, because if you, if you even see a special item... It lowers your chance for another special item. So, I mean, you're kind of just screwed anyway. Or no matter what, to be honest. It's like I, I can't unsee the Celtic Crust. I can't be like, nope, cover my eyes. You know, give me a special item still. Trick you, game. Trick you. Oh, ooh, ooh, that was a little. Whoa, you almost dropped freaking cereal bomb to that on my head. I'm gonna back up a little bit. Hey, hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. How about you? There you go. Isaac's Fork does nothing for us. Does nothing at all. Alright, bombs. Bombs are alright. I think a lot of it depends on this boss room. But we're gonna keep going no matter what because, hey. New item hype. Or an item we haven't picked up before. So that's, you know, that's one less item we ever have to worry about looking for later in the game. When uh, we get closer to Platinum God, because at this point, we're, we're nowhere near Platinum God. Well, okay, that's not technically true. We still have challenges, a couple challenges to deal. And, you know, I wasn't... You know, actually, Famine for Lost this first room isn't the worst. I have to say, it's not... For a lot of reasons. The main reason being that it may prevent something from hitting me. That's a pretty poor reason, in my opinion. Well, actually, it's not that poor. It's actually a pretty huge reason. But hey, man, you never you never know. It could be what saves me. I could this shot could be like homing in on me, and uh, Cuba Meat just blocks it for me and just bees an ultimate bro and and really helps me out. You never know. That could happen. My dreams could come true. Whoa, it's a little too close for me, buddy. When are you gonna go into head mode? Seriously, I'm getting tired of you. There you go. You just get in a little pony mode. Not my, not my fan. You know, when you're just a floating head shooting crap at me, perfectly fine. Easy to dodge. Don't got to worry about other flies. Ball of bandages, that's okay. Of course, because that's the only thing I can get anyways. Alright, what do we got going on in here? Hmm. Yeah, technically, we can, can do this. Okay, we're not doing that. That was a little too close for comfort. I tried to do a little another cool move, but that's just like playing with fire. You're looking to get burned. Ah, we don't have a key to go in there. That sucks. Hopefully one drops. I was worried because explosions and, you know, I almost flew into it while shooting. Which could have never ended good. Hmm. All right, let's come on. I'm good. Oh, small rock, my dream, my dream. 
The best thing I could have gotten, honestly. Okay. Let us play this a little safe and go to the corners just in case we need to go over a rock or something and do some moves. Thankfully, we're safe. I scratched my head a little bit there. Not that kind of hand, dirty mind. God. Alright, come on, Key. I want to go into the treasure room. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me, game, and don't let me even go into the treasure room. You asshole. Okay, we do have a bomb. We could possibly check over here. There could be a key inside. Okay, well, it's not there. Oh, we might be able to bomb into the treasure. Oh! <laughs> oh! That was not pleasant. Not even in the slightest. You don't understand how scared I was there. I thought I was dead. Okay, we can bomb ourselves into the treasure room, and that makes me actually very happy. Alright, give me something good. Spiders, let's walk out, walk back in, because I don't even want to deal with them. Slow bite. That's, that's pretty good, I have to say. I'm glad I went to go look for that. Or went to go bomb myself. Oh my god! Ho! 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 I am Santa Claus, apparently. And I almost got myself to spikes again. Whew! Alright. Alright, be careful. Man, gotta be on your toes. Your tiptoes. Let's go. Who do we got? Monstro? Not too bad. Not too bad at all. Uh, try and be far away at all. Oh, motherfucker! You asshole! What in the hell was that, Monstro? <laughs> oh my god, he never has done that his whole life. In the whole history of Monstros, that's never happened. He's always jumped to where I was standing. At when he jumped. And all of a sudden he decides, I'm going to go jump the fuck right on top of you as you move. Oh, I'm so, I'm so mad. I'm so mad at that. At least we picked up a nickel, right? Yeah, a nickel. That was retarded. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, it's something to laugh about, though. It's something to laugh about. It was funny, I have to admit. But I was hoping that wasn't how I was going to go out. I was, uh, I'd like to at least to see my freaking devil deal, my first devil deal is the loss. Because honestly... You know, there, that could have been the best run. You never know, it could have been the, the freaking devil room. Brimstone freaking Abaddon, I say that all the time. But that would be like the ideal run, or Brimstone Pentagram, or Brimstone Pentagram God's Head. God's Head, I mean Goat Head. God's Head would be great too, but we don't have uh, that unlocked, and that's only from uh, God Room, so. Obviously would not get them there. Alright, game. Why do you take so long to give me my treasure room? I gotta go all the way back, all the way back here and look for it. I don't like that. It better be over here. Why is this basement so obscenely large? Our room, our floor is larger in the in the hard mode. That's an interesting question because I feel like this floor is freaking huge. All right, maybe you give me small rock again. Uh, you give me a golden key. It's not half bad. I doubt I'm going to have an opportunity to actually use it, though. Is the truth. Because, there. I mean, I can go into the, the shop. Or, is this... What is this? Two different shops. Alright, so one of these might be a library. Which could be very good. Could be something else, too. Woohoo! You were a sneaky fool. I would like to get rid of these guys as quick as possible though, so I can, you know, weigh my options and see what we got going on in here. That makes sense why this floor is bigger though, because it has extra rooms. Oh, okay. I mean extra special rooms. You get what I mean? What is this? Libra, you feel balanced. I believe that balances all of our stats and gives us uh, certain items. So, Book of Belial, I'll take that. It would have been nice if I had Book of Belial used it and then picked up. Uh, Libra, because then it would have balanced my stats and gave me probably a better bonus. But there's not nothing, or there isn't anything we can do about that now. So, we're just going to have to deal. Headless Horseman. 
Again, wh why why am I running into you, you, you famine-y, horseman -y guys so often? I don't like it. I would like to enjoy, you know, my first boss room without you being an asshole about it. There you go, you're dead. Exactly what I wanted. Okay, that, see, that's why I don't like charging enemies, man. They move a lot. Freaks me out. Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? What are you going to do? You can't run forever, can you? Alright, to do this, a little bit of damage. He's like, like only a couple shots away. And of course, we already know what's going to drop. It's a cube of meat. Oh, never mind. It's a pony, but we already have flying. And Book of Belial was much better than that. A damage increase is going to help us out a lot more than, you know, double flying would ever do, you could say, because, you know, we already got flying. Get the joke, bro. Haha, -ha, JPEG. <laughs> uh, I like making really bad jokes. Let's blow this up. When are we going to get our D4, man? Where the hell's our D4? That's what I'm hoping for, man. I've been waiting. I have no idea how far away it is. But I want that shit, yo. Because that's a crazy-ass item if we ever get one. And, you know, in sometime, sometime this century, hopefully. I would like to take away the black ones first. Because these ones, these smaller, uh, already bigger flies, I mean, cannot evolve into something even larger than they already are. So I would like to take them out first, because they can turn into little gray flies. At least they did in Vanilla Isaac, I'm sure they can still do that. That's why you don't ignore them. You don't ignore the passive flies because they can turn into something that's not passive. You know, they metamorphosize into a, a Voltron, you know? You know what I'm saying? What in the, I can't even hit that. What am I, what, how was I supposed to even deal with that? Okay, we need to wait for this one to fly out okay that's that's I can't even deal I can't deal with this fly I just can't he can't do anything to me I gotta wait for him to move out like really far there we go go behind him and then start shooting woohoo okay this is just a dumb fly that was unfair man well, I died. Explosive diarrhea does that to you. Sometimes you die. Dysentery dysentery used to be a very lethal thing in the past. It, it used to be extremely lethal, actually. Um, people would die of dehydration because they did not know they needed to drink water while they had explosive diarrhea. Well, not explosive, okay. It wasn't exactly exploding, but you know what I mean. That is just absolutely useless. That's actually the first time I resetted. Y'all should be very proud of me. But uh, technically, it was all the game. The only reason I didn't reset is because the game was actually giving me halfway decent things when I re when I died. So, uh, X-ray, um, I guess. You know, because I could come across, you know, like Epic Fetus or something, or something really insane. You never know. Though I don't expect my to live with an item like this. Especially in Cellar 1, as Lost. You know, it's a really cool, like, utility item. But as an item that's going to lead to your inevitable success? Ah, uh, hell no. It's not going to do anything like that. It's going to do a big box and nothing if that's what you're expecting. Come on, just die. Just die so I can take it down. There you go. You know, it's funny that their head is able to get destroyed, but not, you know, as, because they regenerate, but not the rest of their body. Bad gas. Amnesia, doesn't matter. Base with one. I can see forever. I already have that pretty much game. Come on. You do better than that. You do better than that. Range up. All right. Not half bad, but I, you know, it is the pin too. So not half good. It's gonna be a long first boss battle, but it's gonna be a boss battle that isn't Cuban meat, so we got that going for us. Should be a freaking miracle it's not the Cuban meat. Alright, yeah, it's gonna it's gonna be a long battle, that's for sure. 
There's no denying that. Man, this pin likes to come out of the ground a lot. To fire at me. And I didn't think he was going to jump that far. Alright. I thought for sure his jump was much shorter than that. I, I will make sure never to you know be anywhere near when he lands now. I was sadly mistaken. Is this an XL? No? Is this the Curse of the Blind? Man, this is way more than a room I want to start off. I want to find the damn treasure room. Get that out of there. I don't want to see that anymore. Treasure room, please. This shouldn't be too much to ask for, I would think. Dude, you little dingling, please die. Ah, there we go. Alright. Ah, there we go. Treasure room. That's what I was looking for. This would be a very scary room if I couldn't fly. Like, extremely scary. Thankfully, this is really wide open, and I feel like I can dodge very easily because it's so wide open. So I like that. There we go. Whoa! Uh, uh. Back up. Scared me a little bit. Alright, what do we got in the treasure room? That's right, we got Curse of the Blind, Aquarius. <laughs> no, I did all this work for Aquarius. Is that what the world has come to? Just want to watch the world burn with Aquarius, huh? Aquarius is not to my liking. All right, all right. Come on, I'll line up and go for the takedown. Would you like to get uh, smacked down on my knee? Or I'm trying to make wrestling references, but unfortunately, I don't know much about wrestling. Oh my god. What in the hell is that? Come on, game. That is the freeze effect. Okay, maybe. Maybe. This could be really good. Now, whether we survive or not is a whole nother question. Because this is Cellar 1, and it's not a damage up. While it is a really cool and uh, efficient... Well, I don't know how to words this properly. While it is a really cool and useful tier effect, I guess all tier effects are useful, it's uh, not something that causes more damage. It causes freezing effect, which you can do more damage to as they're not moving. But there's a lot of other things that work your way into that. Or work, work their ways into that. What would be really good with this is if we got a lot of luck ups. That's for sure. Luck ups would be freaking fantastic with this. Come on, come on. There, Don't do that to me. Don't be trying to be all sneaky and try and do the one, the one fell swoop onto me, alright? Spiders. I've had enough of that. I need to go check what that pill is. No, 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 no. God damn it. I try, man. I try to do good things in the world, and the game's like, no, you can't do that. You're too good. I understand. It's a gift that they don't want me to have. I'm going to do this, see what happens. Ah, not that bad. What kind of a waste of a bomb, to be 100% honest, but... Overall, I liked it. I liked it a lot. This is a new room. We've never seen this room before. I love I love seeking new rooms. There's a lot of rooms you see over and over, but then, you know, occasionally from time to time, you're like, I've never seen this room in my life. And I like it. Gamepad, though? I'm not starting with that. I'm not dealing with that either. Okay, this is what I'm talking about. This is the kind of stuff I want to see to start. You know, walk in, treasure room instantly. What do we got? Because I need to know. Uh, Demon Baby is not quite going to cut it. Not quite. It is a damn... I bet that one has Polythemus in it. Curse of the Lost. It's the Cellars. Oh, oh no! Why did I restart? I'm so stupid! <laughs> that could have been... Dead Cat, damn it. Oh, that was stupid. That was legit dead cat. Cat right there. Wow. Ah. You know, that was just bad. I lifted my hand. Oh, okay. Sad onion. Not bad. Pretty decent rate of fire increase. Or tears up, you, you could say. I'm just bad when it comes to spiders, man. 
There, there's no, there's no explanation that I could offer there. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay, no. That was the, like a nightmare that I just looked into. Man, this would be super cool if one of these were a telepill. Oh, I tried. I tried. I can only dream so much, you know. Poor Babylon would have been a decent first basement item, I suppose. Or basement devil deal. For a first floor. That was like kind of underwhelming. You know, normally I'm going there and I see like rims, you know, something else cool. You know, something I like. Uh, do we do it again? Yeah, we do. I didn't nearly pay off as much this time. Our rate of fire is absolutely crash. Or crap. And our damage is only slightly increased, which is, you know, damage up is a damage up. At least it wasn't all negatives. Our speed seems unaffected. Our shot speed seems maybe faster than normal or the same. I don't know. Our HP obviously is unaffected because we don't have HP. Or it is affected, we just, it doesn't exist. All right. I don't know about this. Not nearly as beneficial as the last uh, experiment. God damn it, game! I just want to win and go somewhere. Some type of success. Don't you understand my pain, game? This is lost. Give me holy mantle or something. You know, I don't have any right to complain because the game has given me some great stuff, but I'm just so bad that it I died anyways. That's the problem. Game game has given me some great stuff in the past. It just I'm bad. I'm bad and I know it. And being bad has caused me to lose, you know, what could have been freaking fantastic runs. That's, that's the problem. Could have been absolutely fan cursed eye. Why did I pick this up? Why, why did I do this to myself? Why, why did I, why did I pick this up, damn it? Well, to be perfectly honest, I'm, I'm a little glad I died there. A little bit. So far, I haven't been happy with any death other than that because it, I picked up the Cursed Eye on accident. I almost got hit there. Alright, this is going to be our last... Uh, okay, no. I was going to say it's going to be our last uh, little run with the, with the loss, but come on. That's got to be better than that. You know, telepathy for dummies? Uh, no, man. Can you give me something de halfway decent? No, not bum friend. I said halfway. Not one-eighth of a fraction. You know, of, an, of another fraction, because that was poop. Honest to God poop. You know, this is this is a representation of what you just gave me. Any other character would have been okay. Would have been a nice HP up. Even though, wait, it was Lard, wasn't it? Isn't Lard still speed down? I might not have picked it up on any character, actually. Speed down, you know, is, is pretty... It's, it's pretty uh, severe, is what the word I was looking for. What's this? Conjoined friend. Uh, all right, we'll do it. We'll do it. But I'm not gonna like it. I just hit my mic on accident. That just happened. Okay, that just happened. Bag of pennies. What do we got in here? Nah. Alright, that's that. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done with this for this right now. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed the episode, don't forget to leave a like. It's very much appreciated. And I'll see you guys next time with many more Binding of Isaac episodes to come. I'm Sergeant Kenai, and I'm signing out. See you guys next time.